that's it. We bought a truck. It's a Mazda, as you can see. The color is, I don't know, what's that brown. color? Brown. But it's not, I don't know. Not, not Divi, brown. It's not really brown, but I don't know what color it is. But it says brown. But anyway, if you look inside, it's all leather seats. The air conditioner is killer. It's got a good stereo system with Bluetooth. It's a diesel. Uh, reverse camera in the mirror. It's a four-door. And it came with the, the waterproof mats and the, I don't know what to call this. The protective... I don't know what the hell you call it. I don't know. The protective whatever it is to protect the carpet. And uh, the bed protector. I mean, everything's good. They sent it to the dealer. They sent it to the dealer. We got a new battery. Um, and they repainted a spot. One little spot on the back. No big deal. But... You can look at the truck if you come around. You can look at the truck. There's no big scratches. And there's no big dents. There's, it's like brand new. We've had it for two days. Oh, it's got the side steps. Um, it's got uh, 78,000 kilometers on it, which I translated to miles was like 56, I think it was. 56,000 miles. Which is nothing, it's like brand new, it still smells like brand new inside. But anyway, the whole point of this video, the whole point of this video is going to be to tell you how I did it. How how a foreigner, how a farang, foreigner and entire farang, how a farang can uh, get a new car. If you're not paying cash, it's not so easy. If you have cash, you can do anything you want, no big deal. Uh, if you're a foreigner... How I got this truck, and I'll show you later in the video the process, but I'll tell you the process right now. Uh, I've been living here for three years. I've had the same job for two and a half years. So they see that income coming into K-Bank, my bank K-Bank. They see the income coming in all the time. So there's an income minimum, and every bank is different. Uh, K-Bank is uh, $50,000 a month. Uh, so anyway... Uh, you've seen two videos ago, we were truck shopping, just showing prices. And I said I wasn't really looking for a truck, but if I found one for a good deal and I could get financing that, okay, maybe I would do it. Yeah, well, I did it. And the process is, first we went and we looked at trucks, we found something we liked, obviously. Um, and we went to some other dealers, and one guy said, no, I, I can't help a foreigner. Another one said, mm, maybe, I'm not sure. Another one said, oh, yeah, I can find it. Uh, I can find this, a, a truck that he had for us. Uh, interest rate was 6 or 7%. Um, he wanted a whole bunch of money down to get our payment where we wanted it, if we were going to do it. Uh, anyway, so the first dealer, in the first video, we went to the big dealer. I called up my bank. I wanted to see if I could get a better interest rate. I called up my bank. I told them, and they said, we only want to deal with this big dealer. It happened to be the first one that we went to, that first video. So uh, so we went back to that first dealer, and I found a truck I liked, and then I called K-Bank back, and I told them, hey, have a truck I like. Can we see if I can get financing? And that's it. I'll show you what paperwork we needed, the visa. My visa had to have a valid visa, passport, all good, uh, work permit, all good. Uh, income salary coming in every month was good. Uh, I had to get a letter from immigration, uh, which was a registered address where I live in Thailand. Of course, the bank wants to know that's all legit uh, in case they have to find me, I guess. Um, I don't know. There was a couple more things. Uh, you do have to have a Thai person, some Thai person that you know they have to sign. It's, I think it's not as significant as it is in America, like a co-signer, but they're kind of vouching for you that, yes, I know him, he's a good guy, if you can't get in touch with him, you can find me, I'll help you find him, stuff like that. So you need a Thai person to, to sign also. Um, that's it. We did put a little bit of money down. Um, put a little bit of money down. You, you'll see everything coming soon. I, I sped up the video when I... I indicated what was happening. So we met with the K-Bank representative, signed all the paperwork, talked about the interest rate. I got a lower interest rate, like 5% interest. 
um, figured out all the financing, the K Bank, man, they, they did everything. K Bank and the dealer did everything. I didn't have to go to the government to file paperwork. I didn't, I didn't have to do anything. I just went to the dealer, found the truck, called the bank, did the paperwork. The bank called the dealer and said he's he's good to go on that truck. So the dealer called us, hey, when do you want the truck? Uh, you tell me how long you need it for dealer. The truck didn't have a lot of problems. They said a couple days, boom, in a couple days it was done. From the last video that we've seen that we truck was, was truck hunting. So now we have the truck for two days already. Uh, the time that K-Bank took and the dealer took and sending it to the, the Mazda dealer to fix a couple minor things, new battery. Um, that was maybe five or six days total. So the process didn't take long. So you can get a truck if you want to finance, if you have a similar situation as me, where you've been living here, you work here, you have sat consistent salary. Um, I didn't have any prior credit here. Thailand has their own uh, national credit service, national credit bureau, whatever it was called, but it was national credit something. Um, similar to in the US, uh, US, we have the three major credit bureaus, so they have their own here. They checked that. I didn't have any established credit prior to this. I just recently got a credit card, um, but I've only made a couple payments on that, so that was no big, huge help, I think. Just the minimum of, of what I had is minimum you need. So, so you can get a truck if you want. Better if you have cash. Just pay the cash. Boom, sign the paper, you're done. Um, I will give you updates if anything happens with the payments or some weird stuff goes on. But we went to the dealer. You'll see we signed the paperwork. They gave us the key. We left. The plate's already in my name. Insurance is already in my name. Uh, everything's in my name. Everything's done. We got the truck. Everything's happy. Happy, happy. You happy, happy, Juan? Yeah, sure. Yeah, Juan's happy because what we plan to do, or her big plan, is next month. Next month is April. And it's uh, Song Fang, which is like their big New Year, uh, Thai New Year party. Uh, this month, it's, uh, sorry, this year, it's like two, three weeks long or something. It's, it's a long holiday. But anyway, uh, what they do is, they, uh, you must know, maybe you don't know, some claim they always throw water on each other. The idea is to wash away the previous year and start fresh and everything's new and nice and you can start the, the new year new, anew. So, the plan is, because everyone throws water, everyone loves a pickup truck during Song Kran because you get a big, you know, uh, garbage, big huge garbage barrel and you put it in the back of the truck and you fill it with water and the kids and whoever wants to play Song Kran can stay in the back of the pickup truck and the town we live in, they have a designated area that you can do this. They'll, they'll, it'll be for trucks driving around and splashing water. But the kids and whoever, the adults watching the kids, can sit in the back with a bucket of water with squirt guns or, or get a bowl and throw water at each other and trucks passing by. And it's, it's a fun time. It gets a little crazy. Uh, they can do whatever because I'll be inside driving, listening to music and relaxing and the air conditioning. So whatever, you have fun in the back. I'll be in the front. Everyone's happy. Huh? Sure. So you're excited about that, right? Yes, very. Okay. So is there anything that I forgot one? No, I think not. I don't think I forgot anything. If I forgot anything, maybe I could add it when I edit this video or or there'll be an update in another video soon or something. But, but that's it. So it can be done. Uh, just how I said, you need to have a certain number of things. Uh, I didn't have anything special and I got it done, so you certainly can do the same thing. Easier if you have cash, um, but I kind of wanted to, I wanted to try this, right? I've done stuff in America, finance the car, a house, uh, store cards, credit cards, so if I plan to stay here, I want to establish myself here, so that was part of the reason. Another reason was I've been here for three years and, and I wanted something decent. My, my other car is okay, but I wanted something de decent. Um, and uh, this will accomplish all that. So if I can do it, you can do it.
Bye.